The building next to my building is flaming. It's pretty big, about 20 foot flames. I, I can tell you that the firefighters have, have uh, checked at least one time before the fire got real big. They didn't find anybody. But it's early, so we'll know more later, okay? Flames poured through what was once High's car wash on Rossville Boulevard in Chattanooga. Fire officials say the first call came in right around 11 p.m. Oh, man, I, I seen something flaming up in the back of the building, and I ran out and looked across my building. The flames was, man, 25 feet up in the air. started off with a lot of phone calls. Evidently, a lot of passing motorists saw the fire initially. And when we got there, a good portion of the building was already engulfed in flames. Those flames and the cloud of smoke were clearly visible for miles. This was the scene from Lookout Mountain. The blaze was so intense, firefighters could only conduct a brief preliminary sweep of the property. They got a telephone pole ready, on fire right in front of the building. It was blazing. I thought the transformer was going to blow up. The Chattanooga Fire Department brought in 12 crews and roughly 50 personnel to battle the fire. By 1 a.m., most of the external flames had been extinguished, but firefighters say putting out a fire that size is no easy task. Small pocket fires are expected to smolder well into the morning while fire crews continue their work. High's owners didn't wish to speak on camera but said the business was at least 50 years old and currently providing jobs for some 15 people. I remember this place being here when I was a kid when 23rd Street was a dirt road. So they've been here a long time. Initial sweeps of the scene lead firefighters to believe that no one has been hurt in the blaze, but reports say homeless do occasionally seek shelter in the building next door to the car wash. That building was also completely destroyed. Renee LaSalle, WDEF News 12.